Hey everybody, it's Mr. Marshall at Stony Lane. Um, last time we were together, we started talking about this new kind of writing called opinion writing, where you're trying to make other people believe what you believe. But sometimes you don't even know what you believe about a topic, okay? And so I wanna show you about, I wanna teach you about a, a tool that I use sometimes to help me figure out what I think about stuff, okay? And so, ready, here's my tool. It's called my little notebook. Okay, this is a notebook that I keep in my bag. I just made it out of paper and stapled it together. It's nothing fancy, but you can also just buy a little one of those tiny notepads and use it. Okay, and your little notebook is a place where you can just like jot down things that you see around you. Okay, things that you what grown ups call observe. Okay, things that you notice that maybe you never noticed before. Okay, so here I've been doing this for a couple days now. So, um, Right here I have, I have really bad handwriting here, but it says at ShopRite, six people wore their masks without covering their noses, you know? So like we're wearing our masks and, and like, and they're wearing their masks kind of like this. So it's not covering their nose. And like, that's not the right way. Like they're supposed to cover their nose and their mouth. So I just noticed that six people were doing that. That's kind of not right. Then I have my brother. Let's see, came over right away as soon as I needed him to help me fix my thermostat because I needed a new thermostat, and he's really good with stuff like that. As soon as I called him, he's like, I'm coming right over. I'm going to help you. Today I heard people say, stay safe five times. Like sitting here in my office, I heard people as they were walking out of school, five different people saying, stay safe. And then it made me think of how many people I've heard recently say, thank you or I hope you're well in an email, right? I think people are talking, like they're saying nice things now. What else? I have a couple more things in here. I have, um, oh, my neighbor Donna waved me in in my driveway. So I was like trying to pull into my driveway and she saw that I was coming and she was in. She did one of these, you know, where like she let me go in before her. So um, as she was going into her driveway. So there's some cool stuff in here. There's things that this notebook has made me think about that I maybe wouldn't have thought about. Okay, so one way that you can use this notebook to help you figure out how you feel about things is to pick one thing that you jotted in your notebook and then make a T-chart with, with how you feel. Okay, let me show you what a T-chart is. A T-chart is a place, it's a chart that looks just like a T. That's why we call it a T-chart. Okay, and the part on the left, I'm going to put um, one of the things I noticed. So I'm going to put... Um, I'm going to put the stay safe. So people said stay safe five times, right? Five different people said stay safe today, okay? So on the column on the right, I'm going to put my thoughts or my ideas or my feelings about that, okay? So I'm going to say... People, I guess since there's this coronavirus going on, people are thinking more about other people. Like they're hoping that the other person stays safe. So people think more about others. What else does it make me think? I'm going to try and put down a lot of thoughts. Right? I'm going to kind of, like what we say, squeeze your brain. I'm going to push myself to have a lot of thoughts. Um, that makes me feel, or the person that they're saying it to, I think that makes them feel better. Like, people feel better because they're feeling like people care, right? People feel better. What else? That's making me think, if you talk nicely like that, you get into that habit, and then you become a nicer person. So I'm going to say you become nicer when you say nice things again and again. So what I can do now is I can write about my thoughts. I can write sentences about my thoughts. Okay. Um, I can turn this into some writing. I've just done a good plan for some good writing and now I can go write it. Okay. So you see what I did? You see how I took things I noticed in my little notebook. I picked one and I made a T chart about all the things that that thing makes me think or makes me feel. Okay, that's one way that you can get yourself ready to write a review, figuring out 
how you feel about something and then maybe others will feel that way too. So why don't you try that and I'll see you next time.